Hey, welcome back. Uh, today we are going to use some of our leather scraps and see how well the laser works on them. Don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. All right, so first we're going to power scale some of our leather to see how it does. We'll shrink it down so that we're not, you know, using the entire leather piece and see how it does. And then we'll try out a design on there. So uh, we stopped at three of the different pieces. They're all relatively the same. Um, really, as long as you're, aside from white, as long as you're over 30%, it's gonna look really good. Uh, white just needs to go a little bit higher, up into like the 70% or so, and then it starts to look really good. Uh, so that's the power scale. We're not gonna do all of the rest of them. Um, if we have a special project, we'll probably test a little piece of it first all right so right now uh, we're gonna throw in another piece and put our brand on it and see how we like the way that looks Alright, so we've got our pieces of leather. Like I said, they were just scrap leather. Um, 
We had the power scale on a few of them. Yeah, don't forget, always power scale. Yep, just to see how they did, how they looked. It might seem like a waste of material, but it always is gonna save you material in the end. Yeah. If you ruin a whole piece, you'll be upset. Yeah, and we made it much smaller because, you know, there's not a whole lot of leather on some of these pieces and still leaves us a good chunk. I went ahead and did our brand on one of the darker ones. Now this one has some texture, so it is a little harder to see yeah, our brand at certain angles. But love the way that it turned out. Yeah, it came out great. All right, so we did 3,000 millimeters a minute on all of these and just, you know, picked the percentage we want. I went ahead and did 40% on this piece. Came out nice and dark, great black. Um, like I said, you might have to do it a little darker if you're doing white or mm. maybe a little darker with a lighter tan um, leather. But all of the dark leathers, 40 and up, look jet black. Yeah. Cutting in here real quick. Uh, goes to show you uh, as soon as you think they're all gonna look the same doesn't look anything like the rest of them uh, the wrinkled leather uh, you can see there it does etch it it does get it it just doesn't uh, turn out dark and it's really really hard to see so again power scale everything uh, we know we should uh, but we did three of them and thought they'd all be okay but they're not um, so threw this one in nice dark leather and it looks awesome this is already wiped off, no soot left, and that's what you get in the end. So this is 3,000 uh, millimeters a minute at 60%. All right. All right. So maybe we'll get Rory to draw us up something, have a nice custom design. Yeah. Yeah? All right. <laughs> well, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe, we'll and uh, we'll see, see you next time. time.